Hey guys, okay, so I have um, uh, an update for you here. It's uh, not a patch or vinyl update, it's a cassette update. So, tapes. Um, I have seven of them, and there are four Megadeth and three Iron Maiden, so let's get to them. <clears throat> and these tapes are all original, by the way. So, I'm sure I'll show you Megadeth. Uh, this one's Killing Is My Business, and Business Is Good. So here's the, oh, it's kind of blurry, here we go. Uh, there's the track list, and there's no like sleeve inside, so um, there's that one. And we have Peace Sells, but who's buying? Uh, we have the track list here, and let's open it. Uh, I'll open it really quick. Tape out. Alright. So here's the little the inner sleeve. It doesn't really open too much. Just like this. Opens. You have the band here. Uh, there's no lyrics, which is weird. So, yeah, there's the inner sleeve. <clears throat> Put that back in there. So there's P cells. Oops. Alright, so Killing is my business and P cells. We have So Far, So Good, So What right here. And here's the back. Oh man, it's kind of blurry, I'm sorry. So there we go. Alright. And I thought I thought it was so funny that I found uh, this on their explicit lyric parental advisory. That's the sticker that came on it when I got it off eBay. Yeah, I got I got these all off eBay by the way. And these are all original uh, tapes, like I said. So that's that's pretty funny that it has a explicit lyrics parental advisory sticker on there. So yeah, there's so far so good. So what? Let's open it. Take the tape out. Right, so this is the inner sleeve. Same as the vinyl, same picture. Uh, here are the lyrics. It's kind of blurry. Here we go. Alright, so there's that in your sleeve. Let's put that away. Tape back in there. Okay. Alright, so there's the three Megadeth so far. And the last one for Megadeth is Rest in Peace. And here's the song track list right here. And let's open it. Tape out. Check out the inner sleeve. Alright. So let's just open this. Alright. So here you have uh, the band. So you got Dave. Nick Menza, David Olson, and Marty Friedman. This right here in is personally for me is um a great lineup for Megadeth. I think this lineup for Megadeth was pretty damn awesome. Nineteen ninety was a good year for Megadeth. Clash of the Titans tour, a Grammy winning album. Pretty much Megadeth's like uh, golden year. They had they had their golden years too in the eighties and pretty much after Countdown to Extinction for me, Megadeth kinda went downhill. I I do enjoy um Endgame though. It's a really good really, really good album. And also United Abominations. I love that album. But uh everything else kind of just doesn't really I'm not a really big fan of uh, you know, anything else they've done. Uh so yeah, but th this album is really, really intense, really awesome, and so are the first three Megadeth albums. They're really, really awesome, really, really good. So yeah, here's the band. Here's uh the band again. And then we got Rest in Peace right here. I need the lyrics on the other side. So yeah, there's there's that in your sleeve. Oops. I can close it. There we go.
Put that back in there. And put the tape in there. All right. So there, first four Megadeth uh, albums. Next, we'll move on to Iron Maiden. So, we'll start off with this one. Got Iron Maiden, self-titled. Uh, so you get the front, the back. A little blurry there. Um, and there's nothing on the inner thing. If you can just see. See, there's pretty much nothing. So there's the tape. All right, so there's Iron Maiden. Next. We have Power Slave. So there's the front, the back. Oh, it's right here. Songs. Let's open it. Get the tape out of there. All right. Let's open this. So back here. Oh. I don't want to unfold. <laughs> so back here, have get the front cover. We have them at the mummy's tomb, and we have the back. If it was the vinyl, this would be the uh, the very back of the vinyl, and this would be the inner uh, the inner sleeve. And then uh, that's pretty much it. And then you get the lyrics up here. And you got the different symbols, different Egyptian symbols. So there's Power Slave. Really great Maiden album. In fact, Maiden has tons of great albums. Uh, not a fan of Blaze Bailey stuff. Not a fan of uh, X Factor or Virtual Eleven, but um, I would still say that those, those are uh, Virtual Eleven and. Um, X Factor, still classic Maiden records. Any Maiden record is an instant classic, even though I might not be a fan of the of Blaze Bailey. I mean, you can't you can't deny the fact that those are classic. All right, so and last one we have is Seventh Son of a Seventh Son. I am so glad to have this tape because this is my favorite Iron Maiden album. Second is Killers, but this is the very first, uh, my very first, uh, my favorite Iron Maiden album. My first uh, favorite Maiden album. So. Uh, so you see the front and the back, get the tracks, and let's open this. Um, take out the tape, take out the inner sleeve. I think that's cool how they have those little holes, so you can put it on these things. But, yeah, so, let's open this. Okay. So you have, right here we have the front. Band, Bruce Dickinson, Dave Murray, Adrian Smith, Steve Harris, and Nico McBrain. Obviously, before uh, Janet Gears joined the band and made them six, six people. But all right, so here we have uh, Clairvoyant. Uh, all this is an alternate cover for the Clairvoyant. Um, uh, so then we have right here. Then we have the tracks, and then on the back. Have the lyrics, and then we have different symbols. I notice. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Here's the tracks again. Here's the back. That's what it looks like. Front. So <clears throat> this is easily my all-time favorite Maiden album. Easily all-time favorite Maiden album. So glad that I have this one. So yeah, let's go over these again. We have kind of like a I should like I like to call it now a recap never really I never used to say that but I'm starting to get the hang of it I'm starting to get used to saying that actually so let's go over it so we have the first four uh, Megadeth albums on tape and we have the first Maiden album the uh, we got Power Slave then we have Seventh Son of Seventh Son so yeah so this is what the tapes look like all together it's a little blurry. I'm sorry about that. Let me fix that. There we go. All right, so there are the tapes. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. So glad to finally have this album, by the way. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm gonna. I'm planning on getting more tapes soon. 
So I'm starting to collect vinyl, CD, tapes, you know, the whole thing. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys later.